in uh, thinking about the electroencephalogram, it's useful to go back um, in history and to uh, look at some of the important milestones in the development of the EEG. And the one I'd like to focus on specifically is uh, Hans Berger, who was a German, who was the first person to have recorded uh, an EEG trace in 1924. And uh, this shows you the trace that he actually recorded. Um, and these waves were described as alpha waves. The reason they were described as Berger waves or alpha waves is that they were actually the first EEG waves that were described. There is um, some ambivalence about um, Hans Berger as a historical figure, um, although he made uh, momentous contributions to uh, medicine and neuroscience uh, in the form of brain monitoring, he was unfortunately associated uh, with uh, something called the Ergesundheitsgericht, which is the hereditary health court, um, which believed in eugenics and was involved in the Nazi project of uh, deciding upon people's genetic health and uh, often condemned people to death based on the perception of them being undesirable. 